Hey guys, my name is Chris and I welcome you back to my channel. I hope that wherever you are, you're staying safe and healthy. Today, I'm going to be stuffing our cash envelopes as well as our sinking funds for July 14th through the 20th. So I've got our money from the bank this week. Uh, uh, we will be uh, stuffing these envelopes right here, these are brand new, and I will talk about those in just a second. But let's first go ahead and count how much money we have to use. So 50, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 65, 70, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81. So we have $281 we will be working with um, again, for July 14th through the 20th. So, <clears throat> these, again, these envelopes are brand new. Um, I was using a set of Clever Fox envelopes that I had started using back in January. And some of them were starting to show their age. They were getting wrinkled and, you know, didn't really look good. So, I went ahead and placed an order for some new ones. Um, these are from an Etsy shop called Our Budget Life. I have linked uh, the link. Let me start over. I have left the link to this uh, shop in the description box below, as well as the owner's uh, YouTube, YouTube channel, which is also called Our Budget Life. So y'all make sure y'all check out the owner. Her name is Melanie. Um, she's a great person. And as you can see, she makes really good looking uh, products. So, you will see these as we stuff them. Um, the first one we're going to be stuffing today is our vacation envelope. And I really like these. These are a, a sort of like a C slash nautical mix of envelopes. Um, so, I'm, I'm really impressed by them. I think they look really good. And I thought this one looked good for vacation since I love beach themes. And when I think of vacation, I think of going to the beach sometimes. So... All right, we're going to take our stack of cash over here. And our budget for vacation currently is $5 a week. So I'm going to take out a $5 bill. And let's uh, see what's in there already before we add this five over here. So currently it says our balance is $124. We're gonna count that to verify it's all here. 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100, 5, 10, 15, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. So 124 is correct. All right, so I'm gonna be adding uh, $5 today. And today is the 13th. Let's see. Move y'all in just a little bit here. Kind of see what I'm doing. I'm gonna move these to the side. Don't have much room at this desk I'm working at, so I kind of have to squeeze everything together. Okay, and this is a deposit. So we're adding five. And by adding five to this, this will give us $129. And a um, <clears throat> one of our subscribers, one of my subscribers suggested that I leave the decimal off the, the cents like I always do since I'm only working with whole numbers, so I just figured I'd leave them off and I guess save myself a little room. It didn't matter, it didn't bother me doing it the other way, but this may look a little bit cleaner, so we'll, we'll do it without the point zero zero from now on, for now on. All right, so we're gonna add a five to this stack here. Twenty. 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29. So $129 is what we have now in our vacation envelope. All 
All right, this one's good to go. Our next envelope is car maintenance. I like this one a lot. I like the sailboats on it. I think it looks really nice. Car maintenance gets $20 a week. So we're gonna add this to our stack here. It says we should have um, 250 here. So once we add 20, we'll have 270. So I'll go ahead and add the 20 and make sure our ending balance is 270. 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. 20, 40, 60, 80, 200. 20, 40, 50, 60, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70. So 270. My wife's uh, car still hasn't needed an oil change quite yet. Um, but we're keeping an eye on that. Um, I did have to take the Lexus for an oil change um, this past Monday, but the oil changes for it are still free um, for two years. We bought it certified pre-owned from a dealership and um, I'm not sure when the free oil changes are up, but it was nice not having to pay. I think it was like $100 for that service. So we're gonna add 20. And this will give us 270. All right, y'all, our next category is our gifts envelope. Um, gifts right now is getting $3 a week. So we cut back this category uh, temporarily to uh, just put more money toward debt. When our debts are paid off, then we can start um, maybe going back to our sinking funds and adjusting them some if if I think that's if I think we need to. And I'm looking forward to that time. But as of right now, I'm just cutting back in a few places. So our current balance right now is 24. Um, if we add three, I'll have 27. So I'll go ahead and add three. All right, 5, 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27. Um, adding $3 a week, these ones are gonna add up quickly, so eventually I'm gonna have to trade these out for some bigger bills, I think, just so I don't over um, fill these envelopes, because I really like them. I want them to last as long as I can. All right, our next uh, category, we have this recreation. Recreation gets $5 a week. So take a five from here. All right, so currently we have $19 in there um, now. So I'm gonna add the five. All right, let's see, 10, 15, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. So by adding five, we'll have $24. We haven't, um, we don't expect, I mean, to be, able to be using this anytime soon. Um, so I wanted to keep putting something in it for now. Just when the time comes, we can, if everything, when everything returns back to normal. Which, I don't know when that'll be. Hopefully, sooner than we think, so. All right, so our next category is um, pet, vet, and grooming. This covers all of our pets' um, shots, um, as well as their flea and tick and heartworm medicine we have to order from the order for them every so often, and then when Toby needs to go to the groomer to get a haircut. So our current budget for that uh, each week is uh, $40. We'll have 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 
we put a lot in this because I just, you know, we never know what's going to happen. And I want to make sure that um, I'm, you know, we're keeping them healthy and doing what we need to do. So we're starting on the back side of this budget sheet here. So 813 deposit. We're adding 40. And let's go ahead and add 40. So. Let's put it all together and see what our ending balance is. It says we should have um, 107 right now, so we should have 147 once we count it all. 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 46, 47. Okay. All right, our next um, category, um, which is also a sinking fund, is called Christian Life. Get the money out here. Um, our budget for our Christian Life category is $10 a week. So, so by adding 10, we should have $355. Let's count it and make sure. Our Christian Life um, category includes donations we make to our religious organization as well as if we ever want to help a family in need. Anything that, um, you know, that a, or constitutes being a Christian. Um, or this could include maybe dress clothes that we may want to buy for ourselves um, when we're meeting in person again. As of right now, we are still uh, doing our religious services each week um, through an app. So I don't know when we'll be going back physically uh, and meeting in person again. So let's make sure we have 355. Let me get that in frame. There you go. 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. 20, 40, 60, 80, 200. 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 300. 10, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55. So 355 dollars. I will be putting some of this in the bank soon to um, so that I can um, do a few things with some of the money. So this envelope won't be so thick then either. So. All right, next we have um, house and yard. And I think this is one that we forgot about this month. I forgot this whole category. So I'll go ahead and show you what's in it though. And we'll start back contributing to it in September. So we have 76 in there right now. So 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 65. 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76. And as you see, we've not spent anything from that at all this month. So this is plenty for the month. Um, next is our giving envelope. Uh, we put $3 into that each week. Uh, right now we have $24 in there. I'm just going to mark down that we're adding three. Put that it's a deposit. Five, ten, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven. 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27. 
Uh oh. All right, our next um, envelope is Pet Care. This has like seagulls on it. I thought this was really nice looking. Pet Care gets 30 a week. This includes uh, puppy food, kitten, or not kitten, cat food, uh, fish food, and leopard gecko food whenever we need, um, whenever we need those things. It also includes cat litter and puppy pads, just normal everyday things, week to week things that they need. Right now we have 62 in there, so adding 30 will give us 92. And this is a deposit. So, a 20 and a 30. Twenty, forty, fifty, sixty, seventy, seventy-five, eighty, eighty-five, ninety, ninety-one, ninety-two. Toby is already getting low on his treat, so I will be making a trip to PetSmart probably tonight or tomorrow for some of that. And otherwise, they're good on their uh, food. And um, he may be needing some puppy pads as well. He's getting kind of low on those. Our next uh, category is our fuel envelope. This is only um, added to once a month. And we... Um, we still have some room on our Discover card for gas. Once we run out of how much we like to use on it in a month, we will switch over to this cash to put gas in our cars. So as of right now, we have, um, well, I went ahead and put a new tracker in here and, the, and I got this with the new envelopes, but right now we have 150.55 in there. So I'm gonna put, Actually, you know what? That wouldn't be a deposit. That's just what the um, what the balance is. So let me correct that. Let's see. Okay, and I'm just gonna put over here the balance is 150. All right. I think starting in September, I'm gonna be doing two videos um, for the, the, the envelope stuffing. I'm gonna be doing regular cash envelopes and then doing a sinking fund stuffing instead of doing, doing them all in one video. Um, I'm already at over 18 minutes and I don't like them to go on too long because it can get lengthy and, you know, um, our minutes are precious nowadays, so. <laughs> All right, so our next category is groceries and eating out. And this gets uh, $100 a week. So I'll be using 250s for that this week. Right now we currently have, excuse me, $70 in there. So this will make it 170 in, um, Deposit. We will be getting some groceries this weekend. Uh, we've run out of nearly everything, and we've been eating out way more lately than we than we want to be eating out. It's just easier that way sometimes. But all right, so put all this together. We have 50, 100, 150, 170. This one is good. Our last category is a sinking fund. This is auto insurance. Um, this gets $30 a week. And 20, 30. And let's see what we got in there right now. So currently we have 270. So I'm gonna add uh, 30 to the stack. All 
right, let's see what we have. 100, 200, 220, 240, 260, 280, 290, 300. So. This is building up and in Either June or July of next year, we will be paying it in full. And this is the first time we've ever done a sinking fund for um, our auto insurance. So once we have that paid in full, we will know we will only be saving monthly from then on for the car insurance. We won't be saving for it plus having to pay the premium on it each month. So as of right now, we're putting $30 into this each week plus we're paying. Um, 235 a month for the car insurance until we can get it on a six month or a 12 month um, paid in full um, deal. So that's that. So we have a little bit of money left over. Um, 25 of this will go to my wife for her lunch money for the next week. Um, as I've mentioned before, she keeps her envelopes in her purse. So I just like to put them back in the bank envelope. And when she gets home, I give them to her so she can um, put it in her envelopes. So I put A, lunch, 25. And then this last $10 here is for um, medical slash health. This may include uh, prescription drugs, um, over-the-counter drugs, um, you know, doctor copays, what have you. So she keeps up with that as well. So I'll put that 10 in there. All right, guys, that is all $281. Every um, dollar that I pulled out of the bank has a name for it now. And I hope that y'all enjoyed this. Let me know if you have any feedback, any questions or anything like that on how we budget and why we, um, why we do the things the way we do them or anything like that feel free to um, let me know so i will see y'all in my next video guys i hope y'all have a wonderful day bye